another segment of Yakin' with you, Jagoff, and we are here at the Bawktown Beer and Grill out in Robinson, North Fayette area. Thanks for having them here. We're a toast to you and a toast to our guest here, Dave DeCello, Dave DeCello Photography. How are you, Dave? Good. Thanks for having me. Well, thanks for being here. You're, uh, we've seen your work all over the internet and all that kind of stuff. And uh, first of all, tell us a little bit about the type of photography that you do, because because clearly the pictures are very vibrant, very radiant. So it's called HDR photography. Um, it's, it stands for high dynamic range. So what it does is it combines multiple exposures of the same image, dark to light, to kind of give you that view that your eye naturally sees that the camera can't capture it with just one exposure. So you take five, seven, nine exposures, combine them into one, and it gives you that kind of full range of light that you see in my images uh, to give you that, that painterly, that vibrant look to them. So the camera takes nine exposures itself, or you have to stand there and take nine It'll exposures. take nine exposures by itself. You tell it, put it on nine, hit the shutter button, it does its thing, and then you have nine pictures of the same scene, go home, throw them in Photoshop, and go from there. Now, I have to tell you, Dave, it kind of ticks me off here because, you know, just as they started making cameras that doofuses like me can take great pictures, now you're taking these HDR pictures. I mean, where, where does it stop? I mean, look at the stuff. I mean, I mean cameras have come so far in the last, even like three years. Um, it's amazing what they can do, but it's still about getting to the right place at the right time, you know, getting, you know, waking up at four in the morning to be on the West End Bridge, staying out to 11 o'clock at night so you can get that, you know, great night shot of the Pittsburgh skyline. You yeah. know? So there, there's a lot of that that goes into it as well. What is, uh, what's some of the craziest things you've done to get a picture? Well, one of my favorite shots was down on the uh, Clemente Bridge. It was early in the morning, about seven in the morning, and all of a sudden, I'm lying down, and I was with a buddy, so, I, you know, I'm, I'm composing the shot, all of a sudden I hear, Dave, Dave! I hear these sirens, I turn around, there's a fire truck, there's an ambulance coming all the way down uh, Clemente, so that's 6th Street, coming down 6th Street. So, I gotta get the shot, right? I mean, I can't I can't just run away. So, what a so I gra grabbed, grabbed the shot, grabbed my camera, scratched up the bottom of my lens in the process, but it was worth it, I love it, it's, well worth it, trust me. Now, how does someone find your photographs? I know I've seen you on Facebook. Yep. And uh, Twitter. Uh, Facebook, Twitter. Uh, I have a website, DaveDeSello.com. Okay. Facebook uh, is is my primary way that you know people can kind of gravitate toward yeah. my site. So picture taking for me, you know, I took it in when I was in high school. I mean, it was about black and white film. It was about flash cubes. Yes. You know, yeah, I'm an old guy. So, <laughs> but yeah, you talked about composing the shot. It takes that special, as you said, it's maybe about a lot about skill but how much luck is involved how much is luck and how much is skill oh there's no doubt I mean luck is sometimes better to be lucky to be than, than being good you know <laughs> a couple years ago at a uh, penguin game I had the opportunity to be sitting in the front row you know as the players were skating out and Mike Rupp who's now with uh, Minnesota I believe came out for free game warm-ups just as the spotlight was coming over him as he was coming underneath and it was just this shot that I could try it a thousand times and I might get it once you know so you're absolutely right being in that right place at that right time um, <laughs> there's so much to be said for that you know now I know uh, how good your camera probably is but I would bet that if my aunt Susan took that camera and took a family picture on Easter my guess is no matter how good the camera is our foreheads would be cut off <laughs> there's probably yeah, a lot of Uncle Randy's out there probably the same way you know <laughs> uh, but now so uh, what's your favorite thing to take around or is it cityscapes is it weddings is it well I mean it's I like them both for different reasons. I mean, the Pittsburgh skyline is like nothing else in the world. I mean, it's no matter where you look at it, from the North Shore, West End Bridge, Mount Washington, you know, you're always going to get that that wow factor every time every time you look at it. Uh, weddings, though, I mean, I've been doing weddings for about two and a half years now, and you're seeing two people in the happiest day of their life, you know. It's so much fun. Everybody's smiling. Everybody's happy. Everybody's yeah. dancing. You know, you're on the middle of the dance floor, you know, with your camera up shooting around. You know, it's like you kind of feel like you're part of it for a second, then you realize, oh, wait, hold on a second. I got to go back, go back to work here. <laughs> Have you um, ever been asked to follow them on the honeymoon? Uh, no, no. <laughs> I've had plenty of grooms say, you know, why don't you go hit the bar? It's like, <laughs> yeah, hold on one second. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> now, as a photographer, I'm sure there are people that are pains in the butts 
jag off, so to speak. Uh, <laughs> what is They're the, everywhere. What, <laughs> what is the worst thing that people can do? What can, what can they say to a photographer to tick them off? It, it, it's probably the, oh, you're a photographer. Hey, I take pictures too, you know, and all of a sudden <laughs> they're pulling out their camera or, you know, their, you know, Instagram feed saying, you gotta, you gotta check out this shot of, man, look, look at this shot I took of my niece. It's beautiful, right? I mean, it's, everything all right? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. So, I mean, yeah. I, I mean, don't get me wrong. I mean, I don't mind when people show me, show me their pictures. But whenever it's, you know, fourteen pictures of somebody's chihuahua or well, problem is uh, I don't have a chihuahua, but like this, So this is my dog. This is him with a Steeler hat on. This is him with a penguin. It was since you take pictures for the penguins. Now here's one. He's kind of like mm. in flight, trying to oh, catch the ball. Yeah. You know that kind of thing. And <laughs> oh, here's one where he's actually smiling. My dog wow. smiles. I'm, I, most, yeah. Most, have you even seen my work, you jag off? 